All right, Chubby Cherub. All right, <laughs> never played this. Don't know what it is. Gonna give it a shot. See what's going on with it. All right, bonus point. All right, what the hell? All right. Oh, okay. So you can fly around. I'm just. I'm not gonna let touch the dog, even though the dog looks very friendly. I'm concerned. It makes me wonder. <laughs> so he opens his mouth up like like he's Kirby, which is great. Let's see. Oh, okay. So you can hold the the A button to fly, or the B button to fly. I mean, you can press. Oh shit! You can press the B button to fall. So that's good to know. You have a power meter at the top. And it refills when you eat. I don't know what it means when I'm invincible. Or, well, blinking. It must mean I'm invincible. So stop! 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 Okay. Wait, what's it mean to stop? What's stop mean? I stopped. <laughs> what is it? G A U A. What is it? Wait, do I go over here to this box? Oh wait. Now it's letting me go by. Huh. <laughs> That's a big old me. Now that dog looks mean. That dog actually looks like he's mean. Oh shit. I don't know about these dogs throwing stuff. That's no that's just not right. Ooh, lollipop. Okay, the pit the pit bull is is doing something. I don't know what the hell he's doing, but he's throwing some stuff. Are you? He hit me. <laughs> His projectiles were not kind. Let's see. Oh, you, you can't really adjust your height of jumping. You jump one direction or one height. Let's see. Flying, flying, flying. Eat that food. Eat that lollipop. Dodge them dogs. Dodge that poop bull vomit. Uh, that dog throws stuff. <laughs> Don't throw stuff at me. Eat that lollipop. God, dog, dude. <laughs> Those dogs have some accuracy. Shit. Am I at a different stage? What the hell? Does every dog gotta throw stuff? Does every dog gotta throw stuff? <laughs> Did he gotta throw stuff that fast? Eat all that food. What the hell? Stage one, part one P. Congratulations. What? What? What am I playing? <laughs> this is a third party game. It's made by. It's published by Bandai. But it's made by Tose, to Tobe, or whatever. It's a. Uh, hmm. Huh. Oh, trees that you can't fly through. You can fly through houses. We got trees. <laughs> what am I doing? What am I even doing? <clears throat> I'm, I'm eating snacks. I'm the chubby cherub, son. I'm getting fat. I'm getting. I'm staying chubby. Staying chubby. Staying chubby. Oh shit! Is that mean bulldog shit? Damn! <coughs> can I can I shoot? All right, let's see. Let's get down to the to the nitty gritty. Chubby cherub, a sweet little angel, enjoys eating and loves to help people. But life is never so simple. There are many obstacles he has to overcome before being able to enjoy some delicious food. Or partake in exciting adventures. Dogs are always trying to bite him. Birds continually peck at him. <laughs> and when flying, he often gets covered with puffs of smoke from the chimneys. Even attempts to rescue a friend held hostage are thwarted when a burglar throws firecrackers at Chevy Chair. Wow, well, there's like so much stuff working against this dude. And I only saw angry dogs. <laughs> and all of these keep happening all the time. It's enough to get Chubby Cherub down. But with you at the controls... But with you at the controls, Chubby Cherub can prevail over anything or anyone who hinders him when helping a pal or eating a succulent shish kebab. Make Chubby Cherub's day a great one. He's depending on you. 
Ugh. <coughs> Not really. <laughs> Whatever. <clears throat> Let's see. Control pad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move to the right. Press down. He jumps off. Roof. Move to the left. While flying in the sky, chip chip can move eight different directions. A button used to eject Gal Gal Cannon. Huh? Which fires the heart symbols that Chubby Cherub makes. When Chubby Cherub eats a special candy, he can eject the Gal Gal Cannon several times. What? <coughs> Interesting. Used for jumping up or down. If you continuously press the B button, Cherry Chubby. <sighs> wow. Very tired. If you hold the B button down, you'll fly. While moving on roofs or walls, whatever. While Chubby Cherub is flying, if you press B button, he'll stop flying and come down, and it sucks because he just you can't stop it. To be able to fly, Chubby Cherub has to reach a certain power level. To increase Chubby Cherub's power, he has to eat food. <laughs> Not that hard. It's dodging the projectiles. It's hard. <laughs> he uses buttons to select one player, two player, blah, 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 blah. How to play the game, play your score, play characters remaining, Gal Gal Cannon count, Chubby Chubb's power meter, time indicator, indicator time from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. <laughs> Every time I yawn, my ears pop and I have to sniff to unpop them. Yeah, I know it's weird. The screen gradually advances to the right as the game progresses. Each day covers a different adventure and shows a different scenario. At the beginning of the game, the bonus point is shown on the screen. The bonus point changes with each adventure. In the middle of an adventure, there will be a particular scene that will stop on the screen. The scene cannot advance until Chubby Cherub finds a particular object, food, or person in that scene. At the end of each adventure, Cherry Cherub must open a window of a building to find his friend or to fight off the burglar and rescue his friend. <laughs> Can't stop you on it. Chubby Cherub is often called upon to perform errands or to help people. For example, the professor can ask him to deliver a microcomputer, a particular object, or he is told to give a flower, a particular object, to a mad, to the madman as a present. For having caused problems in the past, or he has to discover a clue to find his pal, Angelo, who has been kidnapped by a burglar and is being held hostage. Dude, there's some wild shit happening in this game. Chubby Cherub must overcome a number of obstacles, dogs, smoke, pipes, factory, force, <coughs> and perform his tasks in a given time in order to achieve his objectives. Alright, uh, here's the Chubby Cherub. It does. <coughs> wow, it's a poor, poor image. A microcomputer, professor, flower, <coughs> madman, clue, Angelo. Wow. Alright, what? Chubby Cherub starts with. And the game starts, the clock at the top of the screen starts ticking away. Any time left on the clock when the game is ended will be added to your score. The clock shows time from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. <coughs> Techniques. <coughs> the height of each jump is always the same. Chippy Cherub can jump on walls and roofs. <coughs> Chippy Cherub is jumping. If you press right or left on the control bed, he can jump to the left to the right while walking to the left to the right. If you make Chippy Cherub jump, he'll go a further distance. Flying while flying, Chubby Cherub moves at a faster speed than while walking. He also consumes more power when he flies. If he moves while eating food, he'll reduce his consumption of power. Chubby Cherub <coughs> must keep on eating food when he's walking or flying. Okay, he's got to continuously eat. All right. While flying, uh, yeah, whatever. Special candy. When Chubby Cherub eats a special candy, he can eject the Gal Gal Cannon several times. This Gal Gal Cannon makes Chubby Cherub's heart symbols. It makes the dog scared and then run away. Okay, I need to really learn how to use that. Invisible Chubby Cherub. When Chubby Cherub eats a pee mark, he becomes invisible and invincible for a short while. But if he is hit by a dog's bow wow gun, he becomes... Bow wow gun. What the fuck? Chubby Cherub's power. Beware, Chubby Cherub must continue eating to maintain his power. <coughs> Chubby Cherub consumes a lot of power when flying. He does not consume as much power when walking. Chubby Cherub's favorite foods. Apples, grapes, shish kebabs, hamburgers, cake. Of course he loves cake. <clears throat> How to find friends. In the last scene of Sub Chubby Cherub's adventures, he has to find a friend in a building. When Chubby Cherub eats food, the window over the food pops open or opens. Uh, his friend could be behind one of the windows, but be careful because a dog sometimes lurks behind the window too. 
How to drive back burger. <laughs> <coughs> At the last scene of some of Chubby Cherub's adventures, he must rescue a hostage being held captive by a burglar. To do this, Chubby Cherub must get a bone while the burglar throws the fire hurt. <laughs> Once he gets the bone, press A button. And the bone will get thrown at the burglar. The dog will attack the burglar. The burglar will get scared and run away. What were they on when they made this game? You know somebody sat down and said, You know what would really make this game funny? Killer dogs and cherubs that have to continuously eat so they can fly. <laughs> and by the way, let's put this random burglar in. And you have to do this random bullshit to defeat the burglar. <clears throat> Beware the following are deadly. Chubby Cherub getting hit by a dog. Chubby, Chubby Cherub getting hit by pretty much any damn thing. Identification of those who obstruct Chubby Cherub. <laughs> dog. Cha Cha. Bulldog. Crow. Burglar. Balloon. Smoke. Sparrow. <laughs> Special technique. Stop mark. In the middle of the first day, a stop mark will appear in the top. Yeah. Dog spatters. Dog's action spatters. Alright. Why did I buy this game? All right. <laughs> let's, let's, let's play it again. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of play. A little bit of play time. <coughs> Come on. All right. Let's be flying. Get that apple. Don't get that pee. We're going to be invisible. You can't get me, little pup. Get them grapes. Yeah. <coughs> Sushi. Get that P. So that way the dog. Oh, shit. Of course. Of course. Of course. Eat the shish kebab. Eat the sucker. Eat, eat the lollipop. Eat the P. Eat the P. Alright. <gasps> Definitely like those shish kebabs. I had some watermelon for supper tonight. Mmm. Some good watermelon. Uh, all right, we're gonna go ahead and fall, bruh. Like for sure, stop shooting. There. <laughs> Even though I think the battle gun hits me while I'm invisible. Okay, we gotta stop. We gotta eat a certain, certain bite of food, or all the food. Oh, there, a microcomputer. Of course, I have eight gal gal cannons. Oh. Oh shit. Take that, you damn bulldog. You bulldog ass bulldog. So, pretty much, the guy got cannon is a projectile attack. I gotta find ammo to use it. Take that, you fucking mutt. <coughs> you can't hang with me. You can't hang. Oh shit, this asshole. Oh, you dick. Oh, oh, this is, this is going to be rough. Yeah, what? Damn right. I'm a pimp. I shoot you with my gal gal cannon. <laughs> I can't believe I'm playing this game. Usually I'd have done put this game down, but now that I've learned how to play it, it's hilarious. <laughs> Definitely one of those games where you want to read the instruction book, so you just just so you know what's going on, so you can't be surprised. All right, here, oh, we we've, we got the end of the stage, opening all these windows. Is that the burglar? No, that's that's my friend. That's the scientist. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. I beat that stage of awesome. Stage two part madman. <laughs> All right, we're gonna fly over them stupid dogs. <coughs> Cupcakes, okay. Grapes, grapes. Apple, 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 apple. I got four, four gals. So I got, I got four shots to kill evil dogs. that invisible yeah that's not even mess with that dog I can just fly over his ass right 
Just fly over him. He died his fucking board off. Yeah, what? <coughs> you can't hang. You ain't got nothing that could take me down. What the hell is that? A candle? I don't know what that was. The clock is like the old classic Nintendo time where every one minute is a second or or whatever. It's crazy. God. Oh, this yappy bitch. Oh, God. Of course I can't shoot that far. Son of a bitch. Really? <coughs> I would like to shoot that dog in his face hole. Dude! Okay, alright, how do you get by this stupid dog? <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, but... My damn... <sighs> Goose Fraba. Chubby Cherub, known in Japan as Abaki no Kataro Wanwan Panic. <laughs> Very long... Very Japanese title, which means Kataro the Ghost Bow How Panic is a video game by Bandai for the Nintendo Entertainment System. It is about a flying Cupid like character who eats food and attacks enemies with hearts. The original Japanese version of the game is about a ghost named Kataro, <laughs> a character from a Fujiko Fujo Fujio manga series titled Abake no Kataro. It was retitled and modified for its North American release since its resource material is not familiar. Why well, I'd have rather went with the or other material it would make more sense. Chippy Cherub's friends are kidnapped by several burglars. Chippy Cherub has to save them. However, many dogs are in the way. Chippy Cherub has to cross 12 levels. And at the end of each, <coughs> the protagonist finds his friends. Eating food maintains Chubby Cherub's flight. If the fly meter goes all the way down, the character has to stay on the ground. The character must shoot hearts at the dogs before they bark at the character. If a bark hits the character, the character may die. There are hell and heaven stages. When Chubby Cherub goes down to the stage where it has open downsides, he goes to hell. It is a dark stage, so he cannot see any floors and cannot fly. When Chubby Cherub touches the dog, he reacts like a misfit, but it repeats until he arrives to the exit. Heaven can be reached with a smoke ring when Chubby Cherub touches it by flying from below. Heaven has many cakes, which are worth 500 points each. If Chubby Cherub eats foods every time from the right side since the beginning of the stage until he reaches heaven, the heaven stage scrolls and Chubby Cherub works. What the hell? I, okay. <clears throat> Chubby Cherub, Kitaro the Ghost. Kitaro the Ghost is the main character in the Japanese version of the game, and Chubby Cherub is the main character in the English version. They both fly through the air or walk on the ground. Flying uses the power meter more quickly. If the power meter runs out, the player has to walk on foot. Lollipops give Chubby Cherub, Kitaro. The ability to fire four shots at the dogs. <coughs> Other foods are punished in the meter. Beagles were one of the main enemies in the game. They can jump around on ledges and fence. Some are assigned to one place and just jump in two spots. Others can bark at the player, releasing an icon that must be avoided. It is noted that the barks move with the screen. If coming from the back, they are very dangerous. Yeah, they are definitely very dangerous. The bulldogs dogs are much bigger than beetle beagles. They do not move as fast and bark much more. <laughs> Bulldogs are perched much higher off the ground. Bulldogs are just as dangerous when they bark from behind the player's character. <laughs> cats are less of a threat than the other enemies, although they are impossible to get rid of. All cats are immune to the player's attacks and come in a shade of brown and pink. Sean Riley reviewed Chubby Cherub and stated that, in his opinion, it was the 15th worst NES game of all time. <laughs> Described Chubby Cherub's graphics as ugly. I also said that the cartridge is a waste of plastic and could be used for in many other things. That's pretty harsh. <coughs> I'd have to agree. Nerdicus review. Alright, let's see. Publisher Bandai. Developer Tose Genre. Action. <coughs> Players. One player. Release date 1986. This is the uh, fall of 86, I believe. <laughs> Estimated value is today's at $35 to $40. If you're ever in the mood to play as a naked baby with wings, Chucking hearts at dogs and sucking on lollipops will. Chubby Cherub is the game for you. Just look at how happy that kid is with his fluffy blonde flowing locks and his deformed body. It's such a bad 80s rendition of an anime character, but whatever. We'll let it go. <laughs> I 
Apparently, the original Japanese game was based on a ghost character, Kitaro, from a manga called Abake. Okay, all right, yeah, we already remember. In Cemetery, you're tasked with rescuing your 12 kidnapped friends across 12 different levels, so how about we all get naked like a cherub and sprout some wings and don't forget your hamburger? This is going to be a doozy. <laughs> Let's see. Chubby Cherub scares the crap out of me. I had to say it. The little flying naked baby is the scariest thing on the NES. Don't believe me. Play the game and watch him start eating food with his giant mouth. His mouth is huge. Look at it. Just look at it. Yeah, his mouth is pretty large. It's unsettling. Okay, there's. this is a long-ass review. Uh, I can safely say I'm not surprised this game is considered to be one of the worst on the NES. It's as if someone scooped out the stains from around a toilet bowl and shoved it into a plastic NES cart and said, Here, play me. Oh, it's so edgy. <laughs> <coughs> Not really a great review, but whatever. Um, uh, one out of ten. Uh, the graphics are terrible. The music's terrible. The gameplay's terrible. There's the the, the premise of the entire game is ridiculous. Uh, I would have been a very unhappy child had I got this game. Very shitty game. Ah, whatever. Uh, huh. One of those games that had me yawning the entire, the entire time. And there's apparently there's a two-player game, so I don't know what the hell is going on. Uh, anyhow, if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, <coughs> share, whatever. This game fucking sucks.